Today is November 3rd, 2016. This is Amicus. WikiLeaks just dropped Podesta emails number 28. This one is particularly disturbing. Uh, this is about Ambassador Chris Stevens in Benghazi. This email clearly states as follows. Mrs. Clinton was informed several times in 2011 about the deteriorating security situation in Benghazi and the dangers that diplomatic staff on the ground were facing. Emails show. It, it then goes on to say, Chris Stevens, then a special representative to the transitional government, considered aborting a mission in Benghazi in April 2011 because of the danger, but State Department officials warned that an abrupt departure would send a signal. Now, the reason that this is a pretty striking email is because just internally they're just talking about how Chris Stevens, <clears throat> he didn't even want to be there. And he even told her, hey, I, I want to, you know, I'm considered aborting the mission in Benghazi because of the danger. And the State Department's just like, hey, here's the thing. If you do that, there's going to be blah, 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 blah. And we know how that goes. He died and it was bad. And I'm not going to, there's another email out there and I'll, I'll read it to you guys now. But basically, in a nutshell, it says that, you know, Mrs. Clinton, Hillary Clinton was responsible for the security there. And she was also responsible for the oversight there. And she just didn't, you know, she didn't properly do what she needed to do. And that is a legitimate concern that people have about him dying. So I will bring you a little bit more. There's some Sidney Blumenthal emails I'm going to get to. There's a few other emails. It's a huge dump today. So thank you for watching. Thanks for you know sticking with the channel. And uh, I'll talk to you guys soon.